and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a much, much, much awaited video. Um, it is my purse collection video. I have narrowed it down to some of my favorite purses. Um, there's a few that I left out either because they're old or because um, maybe they're just not my favorite purses. I did have to narrow it down because I have so many. Um, first of all, I just want to give a disclaimer. These purses are purses I have been collecting, some of them for so many years. Some of them were gifts. Some of them I just used my own money to splurge on. So I'm not trying to like brag. You guys have been asking for this video. I actually had several requests for it in my last What's in My Purse video. So that's why I'm doing this video. It is not for any other reason. Before we get started, those are my nails. I did not do them. I finally went to go get my nails done. I love doing them myself, but this time I went to get them done. Also, just because I know you guys might be curious since you'll be seeing my hands a lot, these are my bracelets. This one is from Happy Hippie on Instagram. This one is from Bobble Bar. This is from Pura Vida. And this one was a set on Amazon. And if I remember, I will link these down below. Not sponsored, but I just wanted to throw that in there. So I just have all these bags around me on, on the floor again because that was just the most convenient place to be for this video. Um, and I'm just going to pick whatever's closest and show you guys. So the first one I have here is one you guys are very familiar with already. And it is this um, Marvel Coach um, collab. So let me I'm going to show you all the bags as best as I can. So this is the handle. It's just got this fun little pattern these different stripes and these stars the actual bag itself is a white color and it's got the coach logo all over it and then in the front it's got some different marvel little patches so we've got some spider-man captain america um different patches and then very like classic comic patches i'm a huge comic book fan and i love this bag uh also again very much not sponsored but if you haven't seen black widow at the movies yet highly recommend it once you open up the flap you do have whoa let me try to show you this as fast as i can you guys this little oops <laughs> yeah i'm struggling little pocket here it's a very small pocket the interior is brown and then in the big one you just have a big pocket with another little smaller pocket on the inside i hope you can see that well and the closure is just a little magnetic closure um and then of course the strap does remove however i would definitely keep it on for this bag um the next bag i have is actually one that i um bought when i was with Ana marcela when we went to austin then we stopped in san marcos at the outlets here in texas and um i bought this purse when i was with her and i told you guys i would show it to you in an upcoming video this is that video so it is a coach purse it's got this orange white kind of purple color and it's very pink um it has got two zippers which i will show you the what the interior kind of looks like right now it has got this is the strap kind of different colors on each side you can definitely reverse it um with the little hook or you can take off the strap completely which again for this particular bag I would not do that and just like the other bag it has a back pocket which is small and open but if you want like your phone nearby or something you could totally do that then it has a lot of my bags do have stuff in them so the same like a little pocket on the inside and then it's just a zipper and then a front pocket and there's not much there so that is this one I really love this bag and it's such a fun summer bag that I had to splurge on it. The next one, I got this one for my birthday last year. This is a Versace. It is black. It's got gold accents. I love to take the strap off and just use it once it's got stuff in it. It's a very structured purse. So I love to just carry it um, by the straps. And then it just got one interior pocket not much going on here and it actually you can't really tell because it's black but there is a little tiny pocket on the inside the next bag i have and if you guys haven't noticed one of my favorite brands is clearly coach this is a much older bag that i've had for a very long time um look you see that little it says coach there i've had this bag for a very long time but it's held up pretty well over the years. It's a little faded, but it is this mauve pink color. The interior is just not much, just like this a little pocket. It is zippered and then the big pocket. And it also has this little front zipper and you can put stuff in here. What do I have in here? 
Oh, wow. I guess I took this to Disneyland a long time ago, or Disney World. Has an I'm celebrating button. But anyway, this one's very cute. A little dirty. Like I said, I've had this one for many, many years, but it's still a fave. Another one I've had for many, many years is this one. And this is a Dooney and Burke. Um, and look how beautiful this is. It's just like a really fun summer bag. It's very beachy, really cute. Um, the interior does not have any sort of pocket. It does have a little hook if you wanted to put keys or something. And then it does have two front pockets. Um, and they're just nothing. I mean, they don't have any interior pockets, just the zippers. But yeah, that's what they look like. And the interior is red. It is such a fun summery bag love that this next one is a Dooney and Burke and actually my mom was gonna throw this one out and I asked her if I could have this one as well as I think two others that I'm gonna show you so it's really cute it's small it's a little shoulder bag um, and the pocket is it has a tiny pocket in the inside. I don't know if you guys can see that. I really hope you can. Actually, I think you can see it pretty well. And again, a little hook like for keys or something. The next one is a Michael Kors. Um, this one is, um, what would you call this? Like an off-white color. It's got some gold accents. On the inside, we've got one, kind of like two pockets really. And then we've got like a little phone pocket maybe. Two little phone pockets or like change or whatever you would want to put in there. Very cute, a little bit smaller than some of my other bags, but what I like is even though it's small enough to be a shoulder bag, it is actually really spacious on the inside. Um, one of my most used purses actually is this silver one. I literally used it today. Um, this one is a Tory Burch. The inside just has kind of one pocket dividing your things. And it does have for cards as well. Um, and it's silver and it's really cute. It goes with almost everything. It is very small, very portable, um, not too bulky or anything. This one is another coach one. Um, this one is very cute, very messenger style, but still pretty small and very portable. It is this corally orangey color. On the inside, you've got these two little pockets here that you can use for a phone or something. And then this is just one big pocket and a little, let me open this up, hold on. A little zipper pocket. And sometimes they don't open these pockets a lot. So I have a guitar pick in here and look, this is the weird thing though. I have a tardy slip from my school. I haven't been in high school for years. Let's see if it has a date. Yeah, this is a tardy slip from 2013 for my school. Wow, love that. That was probably my freshman year. Um, yeah, that shows you some of these pockets I do not use. I usually throw my stuff in whatever the biggest pocket is, but that's kind of funny. Also, some of these bags I don't use as much. So yeah, anyways, the next one I have is a much bigger one. This is a, what? Adding that to the bloopers eventually. This is a Michael Kors. It's got these gold accents. I don't know if you can see these little gold dots in here. I really love that detail. Um, it's really cute. And let me show you the inner pocket. We've got this pretty big pocket in here, which has um, this these little smaller pockets inside. I'm really bad at describing these. We've got this big zippered pocket. And then on the other side, we've got this little zippered pocket and then there's these two pockets in here as well i love the size of this bag it's really cute it's a great statement bag as well the color is fun and bold i love fun bold colors or um it's i have like two moods i have fun bold colors and then i have like black silver and gold just very versatile things um this next one is a Love Moschino. I'm obsessed with this one. It came with this little scarf on it, and it's a Moschino scarf, and it's red. I love Moschino, and then it has a Love Moschino, and it's just this cream beige colored bag. Um, it does have this little, whoa, hold on. Sometimes it's a little hard to show things. Magnetic closure, and then the inside is pretty standard. There is a little zipper pocket back here, if you can see that. And then everything else is just one big pocket. Um, let's close that up. 
Moving on, I have a few more bags on this side. This first one is a Michael Kors. Um, it's a little squished because I don't have anything in it right now, but let me try to straighten it out a bit. Actually, I do have a few things in here. This is probably one of my messiest purses because it was one of the ones I would use all the time. Um, but it is this like beige color and it's very structured once you have things in it. On the inside, we do have a zipper, two little kind of like phone pockets, and then over here, we do have as well another little like two little phone pockets. I call them phone pockets, but they're definitely like you could use them for whatever you want. They're just more accessible pockets. And I really like this one. Um, this is again, one of my most used. This other one is one of the other ones that my mom was just gonna throw out and I asked her if I could have. So it is this reddish maroonish colored Dooney and Burke. Uh, wait, Dooney and Burke? Did I say that right? Yeah, I'm almost certain. And it's really cute. It's just a little shoulder bag. It does have a little hook inside like for keys or whatever. And then it has a little zipper pocket right up in here. Um, that's a good pocket for like change or anything. I love the shape of this bag. Um, I think it could be considered like a baguette bag and I know these were really in style and it was around the time when she was going to throw it out. So I was like, wait, I will have it. And in all honesty, I think she was going to donate it. Don't like get a bad impression. I don't think she was actually going to throw it out, but the point is she was going to get rid of it. Um, this next one I have, um, I don't have anything in it. So again, it's a little rough looking right now. It, and it does get these weird reflections on camera, but it is Kendall and Kylie. It is just this red bag, literally just like that on the inside. There's just a big inside pocket. I love the red. Um, I have used it in a what's in my purse video. Um, I do have some cute things from Kendall and Kylie that I really like. And I just love this bag. Next one is the last one I have that my mom was going to get rid of. And it is this coach bag. Um, and it's just, it's really cute. It's black. I love the shape of it. Again, some of these are not very well shaped at the moment because I don't have things in them, but when it has stuff in it, it is a really cool shape. Um, on the inside, we've got these little pockets in here. And then on the other side, we have the pretty standard zippered pocket if you can see that i hope you can because with these black interior bags it's really hard to see and then i think we do have a little hook for keys do we i thought i had seen one no there might just be zippers but um yeah this bag is actually a really cute fun shape when there's items in it we're getting to our last two so this one is another love moschino um, this is a pink one. It's got this strap. You could also remove the strap and just hold it from this handle. Um, this bag I like both ways. It really just depends on my mood or my outfit. Um, I do have matching sunglasses and my wallet matches it. Let's see. My wallet's over here. Let me show you the wallet that matches it. Here we are. This is a Love Moschino wallet. It matches it and I have the matching sunglasses. It was a set I got for my birthday. Actually, I bought myself the purse and then I got the wallet and the sunglasses for my birthday. And this has two pockets. The first pocket has a button or a little snap or whatever you call it. And it's just a big pocket in here. And the second pocket has a little, let me close this button real quick, has a little zipper. It's kind of hard to get through because of the strap, but we just move the strap over. You can't really see what I'm doing, but I'll show you right now. And it's got this zipper with another little pocket in here. I don't know if you can see the inner pocket, but there is a little small pocket in there. And then the last but not least is another one of my oldest purses, but one I've taken good care of, even though it looks squished right now. Because like I said, when there's nothing in these bags, they kind of lose shape. But here it is. It is a purple Michael Kors. I love purple. I got this my freshman year of high school when I was going to a trip to New York. Um, it's just got this big pocket, this bigger zippered pocket, and then it's got this other side with this pocket here, an interior pocket, and this little zipper area here. Um, and yeah, these have been some of my favorite purses. I do have a few more, but they're either very old, they're either maybe some cheaper purses, or purses I just genuinely don't use anymore. Um, but yeah, these were some of my favorite purses. I know you guys have been asking for this video for a long time, so hopefully you enjoyed it. I hope I was able to give you guys a good view of the purses. I thought I would be better off sitting here on the floor, but then I realized 
in terms of the camera angle it was a little hard to show you the interior of all the purses so i hope this was a um, satisfying video for those of you who have been asking for it um and yeah we are not doing new videos every single day anymore that was for june and again we'll do it in a few months in december but we are doing at least once a week i do have videos planned throughout july and august already so i'm very excited for those so make sure you give this video a big thumbs up comment down below which was your favorite purse and subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time i post a video thank you so much for watching bye